Hi and welcome back to Access Tutorial. In this session, it's going to be about adding calculated fields in Access. So I'm going to come in here and just let's create a table first. Create a new table. Let's go to table design and this very one. I'm just going to enter in there. You see, I have a product there. It's called a product ID and maybe give that product a name. Product name. The product ID, let's make that number and the product name short text now. Then I'm going to enter the price there, the price of product, and there let's enter let's say quantity. There we go. And we enter number in there as well. This should be number. Let's make that currency. And here and right underneath here, let's enter total there, total cost. There we go. So in the total cost, I'm going to enter calculated field there. So let's say calculated. Now that that is done, all we then need to do is enter a square bracket in the enter price and we want to multiply that by, close that square bracket, then multiply that by field quantity there. there and that's all there is to it. So let's click on OK. There we go. You can see the expressions showing up. So let's come in here. You see where we see where we have result type. Let's change that to currency. Guess you guys can see that. Let's change this. This is currency here. Okay, right there. And that's all there is to it. So I'm going to save my table and run it. Let's save it first. I will just save save that as cost. Get that right cost. Okay. okay, it's telling me I don't have a primary key. Well, if you want, you can always make this a primary key. So let's make this product a primary key. Then we can just, and I'm now going to also right click and just select the data sheets. Click on yes. There. And right here, let's assume that the product ID. And the product name happens to be let's say rice and here the cost let's say about 13 pounds and how many do we want here let's say we want about maybe four and right here that is the cost of that now let's try not let's try out another product let's say this product happens to be bread how many do we want in there? Maybe 10, 10 loaves of bread or oh, 10 pounds. No, that's too much for a bread. Uh, let's say we want about maybe three of those. There we go. Look at it. Let's add more. Let's say we have, uh, and we have beans in here. And the cost of that is. Yeah, okay, something like that. And um, let's say we need about five of those. And there we go. And that's how you add fields together in Access. So let's go back to the design view right there. Come straight to total here and take a good look at that. Okay, so I'm just going to call it the end of this short tutorial. Bye for now.